So what now for the angels and light workers on earth now that the war is over? Um, well, so most of the collective, they're still in like a 3D mindset um, where they're generating fear and chaos. It'll be much and a great, great amount of it will be relieved. Um, but we're as the angels, the angels still have to um, sustain the energy of the collective. And so we're still going to be absorbing like right now. Um, I'm in the. I'm in Metatron's ship right now and I'm still feeling um, like anxiety and and uh, fear energy from people. Um, but they're saying that I'm here to just absorb and help these people to overcome their fears and worries and stuff. Um, but uh, I do know how to, f like, there's going to be um, a huge wave of people being cured of, of things. Um, like most, like the reptilians and the AI were responsible for most of the cancers and diseases here on earth. So, um, most of those are going to be, are going to be cured. And, um, I've actually been taught how to fly into people's bodies and, cure their diseases. So I'm going to be flying around to the worst of the worst, um, as far as people that are in extreme amounts of pain and, and, uh, I'm going to be flying into their bodies and helping them. Um, so if you, if you want to know more, I guess I'll describe that really quick. Um, so in my mind and in my body, I can select these different frequencies and let's say you're like scrolling through Facebook and you see one of those ads that says, help this child in need. Well, you select, uh, you select their frequency and that like, if you select it and like solidify it in your mind, your astral body will go, will fly. And your soul is very intelligent. Your soul can like, if you just think, okay, I'm going to go there, um, and don't, and like not doubt it your soul will select that exact frequency and location of that person's physical body. Um, you know, they have, they have an astral body and a physical, like an astral body that travels all around, but they have a physical body and you can fly into their physical body. Well, once you fly into their physical body, you select your, your soul gives you the thought, okay, select everything that's wrong with them in their body and select, um, I, I like to say, Okay, so th I was doing the uh, I was doing the the twentieth dimension before, but I really it my soul or Michael is telling me that you select the twentieth density, and you once you've selected everything wrong in their body, you select the twentieth density plus uh, you select. I want to crystallize uh, all of this stuff in the 15th or in the 20th density. And um, once you do that, it's the process is underway and you just sustain that frequency and you can cure cancer basically by, by doing this. Um, so yeah, you fly into their bodies and then do those, those things. Um, uh, I guess a quick rundown again, you, you select the person's body frequency and then you fly into their body, select everything that's wrong with them, select the, the 20th density, plus you select crystal, I, I crystallize and you, you mix all of those frequencies together into one and then you hold that frequency, um, and kind of, uh, like make it collapse in on itself um, like if you can select those different areas with that, that one thing, um, uh, in their body that need healing, then you, you say, uh, and then you kind of mix it with collapsing in on itself. Like, uh, many ascended masters say go inward, you know, and that's what they mean. It means your frequency is collapsing in on itself, which, which takes it like directly to source and, um, you do that inside of people's bodies and, uh, you can heal them. So, uh, good, good stuff, man. Um, uh, go, go out there and heal people with me.
Love you guys. Peace.